what's up everybody we're back with another reaction and today we're going to be uh checking out some tom uh he's got a new new song video out called the machine um i'm sure we could already uh, guess where this is going to be going so let's uh jump right into this uh make sure to hit that like comment share and uh make sure to go to his page uh hit that subscribe button and if you're new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button and help our ch channel grow. Uh, yeah, without further ado, let's see what Mr. McDonald's got the got for us today. I am not Republican. I am not a liberal. Why the hell can I just be American without getting political? The system gonna suppress us all. They don't care about the cost. How is this a democracy when we got communists in charge? Cancel culture. Okay, so we're usual time. Not wasting any any fucking time. <laughs> I am not Republican. I am not a liberal. Why the hell can I just be American without getting political? The system gonna suppress us all. They don't care about the cost. How's this a democracy when we got communists in charge? Cancel culture, Nazis, all they're missing is the swastikas. Honestly, this is a psychological holocaust. Pumping propaganda through the screen and straight into your brain. You ain't on a plantation, but you definitely still a slave. Race theory is indoctrinating children. Tell blacks they're disadvantaged, tell whites they got white privilege. What a brilliant way to reinforce division. If whites believe they have it easy, they will never help you fight the system. And now they burn in books in untraditional ways. They just traded newspapers for the digital age. Now the facts can be deleted with no physical flames. They just change the information and the truth gets erased. They keep screaming to wake up, but they're all woke, not away. We know the system has failed us and now the media's fake. I am not a liberal. Progressive and traditional are hitmen hired to kill the individual. They label people red or blue, divide us. They don't ever help. They want you thinking left or right. So you That's all the red and blue was made for, is just so they can split people up. They've been doing it for centuries. Like, I don't get why people don't understand that shit. Like, forget the whole red and blue. Vote for the person that's going to take care of your country. Who gives a shit if they're a Republican or a Democrat? Like, like I've seen good Democrats. I've seen good Republicans it, and vice versa. Like, I've seen bad Republicans and bad Democrats. Like, it just, when it comes down to it, it doesn't matter what the fuck side they're on. Like, it's, it, People need to wake the fuck up. Stop watching the goddamn news. And actually do some goddamn research yourself. Like. And it really took this goddamn long for people to start actually fucking listening. To have one man start actually not afraid to say the shit in his music. And now, like, some people, some people, not, not a lot, but some are starting to actually, like, starting to understand what the hell's going on like screw the red and blue and screw like this whole fucking division stuff like black and white and all that when it comes down to it, we're all the same inside like th this country's getting real sad and people need to start actually coming together instead of all this bullshit They label people red or blue, divide us, they don't ever help They want you thinking left or right, so you ain't thinking for yourself Go ahead and vote, cause both the parties are the same side Two teams, one coach, controlled by the same guys Left wing, right wing, both See? help the same bird fly Brainwashing everybody at the same time The internet was once a place that we could get our facts from Now it's been monopolized, it's Google or it's Amazon Who fact checking the fact checkers? I can answer that one The people who control the narratives through the platforms Let me break this down for you, simple as I can, Kate They use social conditioning to put you in the rat race it doesn't matter if you're first or third or if you're last place you're still a rat and they're the cats who kill you so you can't escape they keep screaming to wake up but they're all woke not away we know the system has failed us and now the media's fake i swear the government hates us having opinions is dangerous the system built to enslave us only works if we're afraid i am not 
Republican, I am not a liberal. I am just a man who knows they're scared of a nation that's thinking critical. They kill us or they lock us up for nothing like we're criminals. Divide us because they know that unified we are invincible. Questioning the government's agenda is controversial, but promoting guns and liquor in our music is commercial. They're confusing us with pronouns they made up to make us triggered. You can call me what you want, but just don't call me late for dinner. School teaches you to learn and never teaches you to think. So you absorb misinformation, then you practice what they preach. You ain't free, can't you see that's how they want you to act? That's called conforming to the norm, you don't need freedom for that. I'm not Republican or liberal or left wing or right leaning. I took the red pills because that's who's fighting for my freedoms. And you don't need to choose to be accepted. They both fake teams. Evil runs the world now like hell ain't got no vacancy. They keep screaming to wake up, but they're all woke, not awake. We know that he's not wrong. Like most of his songs, he's not wrong. Keep screaming to wake up, but they're all woke, not awake. Good job, Nova. Like always. You know, honestly, I'm surprised Tom hasn't come out with a, uh, this song or this type of song earlier. Is I see so many people saying, oh, he's so right-wing, or he's left-wing, this and that. He straight up uh, laid it down. I'm not either. He's, he's just an, um, wants to be an... Um, you know, he's an American who wants this country to succeed together. Not with all the extra bullshit that people put out there. Like, everybody's fighting over the dumbest shit. Like, everybody, everybody gets so offended by everything now. Like, everybody's walking on eggshells because they're afraid. It's It never used to be like that. Until we started getting having social media and all this other shit, because then people started growing internet balls, like basically, so because they know they can say whatever the hell they want, because then nobody's ever gonna actually act on any uh, thing that they say to them. Like, and then you got the goddamn news that just—they're just a waste of a uh, waste of time on TV or on the radio. I mean, it's. I appreciate that he actually laid that all down. I mean, hopefully, some people will be able to understand. It's like, it's not about one side or the other. It, it's about everybody. Hopefully, everybody can see that. But, but hell, um, hopefully, uh, everybody uh enjoyed the reaction. Um. Please remember to like, comment, and share, and hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. i uh, got nothing but love for everybody, and hopefully we can spread that love to everybody else. So, we'll catch you in the next one. We'll see y'all later.